Rob, there were two reformers selected today by a federal judge to correct the course of Chicago's police department. A former Illinois Inspector General, Maggie Hickey, and retired U.S. Judge David Corr appointed to administer the consent decree aimed at reforming CPD. Both of them first identified yesterday by the I-Team as the two finalists for the job, that both were selected tonight being hailed by those on differing sides of the discussion. Over 100 years, there's been six other attempts to do reform. This one, in my view, will stand the test of time. And the official reform clock is just starting today here at police headquarters. With this consent decree put in force and former assistant U.S. attorney Maggie Hickey put in charge of monitoring court-ordered reforms at CPD. The surprise move by District Court Judge Robert Dow is to also appoint the other finalists for the top spot. Retired federal judge David Corr will be what's called a special master, someone to keep the reform process on track. You see it as a team doing this? Yeah. There's, there are different roles, and uh, um, uh, it's a very unique uh, circumstance. Illinois Attorney General Kwame Raoul tonight says there is no timetable for the policing reforms to be in place. To make sure that those uh, who have embraced practices uh, that go beyond uh, their authority, who have abused their authority, are held accountable, and that there's transparency around the processes. How will you know when this is fixed? Uh, that's a difficult uh, question to answer, and I, in part it's a difficult question to answer because everything law enforcement reform does not happen under the umbrella of the uh, consent decree. The attorney general took city officials to court in 2017 to force police department reformation, even though today police superintendent Eddie Johnson said changes were being made anyway. We started implementing these reforms, the mayor and I, two years ago, so you're not going to see many fundamental changes uh, on the streets of Chicago, but what you will see is a more professional and dedicated police department. Late this afternoon, the Chicago Fraternal Order of Police filed a motion in the decree case challenging several key components of the reform plan on behalf of rank-and-file CPD officers. A court hearing on that set for next Wednesday morning. Police union has had problems with this from the get-go. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.